I am really girly girl, I guess. Because I was around four girls, there wasn't like an older brother to like rough me up. So I was just always, well, I gotta look cute. My nails gotta be done. My nails kinda are done right now, but I gotta paint them again. I actually learned how to do makeup on um, YouTube. I remember the first time I put on some makeup, it was like I was in seventh, seventh or eighth grade, I think. My mom went out of town. And so I had to experiment. I went to school and my friend, she had on like makeup. She always wore pretty makeup. So I was like, how do you do this? And she showed me how to put on eyeliner and everything. So ever since then, I just started watching videos on how to do makeup. My mom bought me some eyeshadow and stuff so I could play around with it. And it just took off from there. I learned how to like contour and stuff. I'm just now learning how to do it because you have to, you don't want to put too much. You don't want to look fake or anything. So. I mean, I'm starting to do better at it, more confident in myself now since I practiced it, stuff like that. And to do the wings on your eyes, some people can't do it, I don't know how. I think it's the easiest thing to do, but. I wanted to start my clothing line because I'm tall, obviously, I'm 6'4", and most stores that I go to are plus size, but I'm not, I don't consider myself plus size, so it's really hard to find clothing that complement me height-wise and like width-wise. So I wanted to start a store for like tall girls that aren't considered big, but are considered like long and in shape and have a shape and stuff like that. Also for girls with big feet, I can never find like cute shoes or heels. People are like, why do tall girls wear heels? Because I like wearing heels. I don't really care about being taller than everybody. So just stuff like that, having having the ability to go to the store and be comfortable, like picking out something that you feel comfortable in, like wanting to wear.